Having finally settled into our new house, it's time to show you my dining table. And what I'm gonna do here is talk about watches. Tonight, we're talking how we wrap up 20, 30 watches without wasting a lot of bubble wrap and time. What I've been wearing the most recently and what on earth is this? Clean my watches, baby. In the old house, we had a display cabinet where I kept all my watches just out lying around. It was convenient for me to leave my most worn watches just out in the open. But what happened was I ended up leaving a lot of stuff on the table in the cabinet. And in the end, there were about 30 watches. And I was left with a massive task of wrapping up 30 watches. I didn't know how. We were given bubble wrap sheets and sheets of it but to wrap all the watches individually would take I don't know half an hour 45 minutes and it's a total waste of plastic so I decided to not do that this might look really shoddy with Mickey Mouse but of course I treat each bundle with a lot of care these four bundles of watches I reckon total in excess of 100k HK treated with love and care. This method works for both moving house and also if you have a business trip. You don't necessarily have to buy those watch rolls, those leather bags that keeps only six watches. A simple polo t-shirt will carry, we'll find out. One, two, three, four, Five. It might look like I'm those dodgy guys selling fake stuff down at the ladies market, but each of these are all in fact official Seiko or Longines, not even grey imports. You can't get away with not using masking tape. I saved on the bubble wrap, so you have to give me this one. And masking tape is really great because it doesn't leave plastic all over your shirts and boxes. Dun, 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 dun. If you're interested in finding out where I got this lovely pyjama, it's from Marks and Spencer's. Uh, these two really manky looking pairs of trousers, these are just homeware, these are chinos, and inside each pair I reckon they're about 10 watches. When are you going to fly and travel with 10 watches? I suppose now during COVID, when you have to quarantine for two weeks, maybe work a few weeks, and then back into the hotel and quarantine, in total for about a month and a half, about 10 watches. That sounds about right. FYI, these trousers are clean, so it's not like I've been wearing these for weeks and weeks and weeks and they smell bad. They smell very nice. One, two, three, <laughs> four, five, six, seven. Oh, fewer than I thought. I think this has worked out very well. It's the first time I've tried this new technique of wrapping up watches. Every single watch has come to the new house unscratched and in perfect condition. The last lot. Dun, 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 dun. So in a pair of trousers, you can carry seven watches comfortably. I reckon you could squeeze in nine in total, but the lack of space would mean you'd have to be extra careful to make them not bump into each other. The second thing I'm gonna talk about is the watch I've been wearing the most recently, and it's got to be these guys. I have one in green, the classic black one, and a limited one that's got a rose gold bezel, the shroud. Why the tuna? When we talk about hard wearing watches, we think of divers watches. And these divers watches are hard as nails. I don't think there are many watches that you can really throw around or show the strength like this. Now, the table is some kind of marble. 
the shroud is invincible. So having spent about three weeks moving, I wore this watch or this one. Finally, having cleared all the t-shirts and pajamas off the table, let's talk about how I clean my watches. I used to spray all my watches with InsureGuard from a pump like this, but the problem was having cleaned everything for the last year, it got really tiresome. And once you spray it, you have to wipe it. So imagine that's a towel. This is soaking wet. You can let it drip dry or you can wipe it. So recently, recently being maybe <laughs> the last couple of months, I've moved on to this. It's a mister which sprays a very light layer of mist onto the watches like this. Job well done. So besides misting and cleaning your watches, you can also clean your cameras like this. Uh, clothes, hats, accessories that aren't easy to wash and clean too. Lovely.